Good day everyone, today we're gonna look at our packing for Moonshine Steel. We will start from the simple to the complex. So, first of all, simple stainless steel mesh. This is our usual stainless steel mesh which goes into our uh, steels. Most of our steels consist of this type of packing. Uh, in some modular one and uh, highly recommended we already put SPP but we will talk about it later. So first of all this one and secondly secondly we have a uh, Cooper mesh. So those rolls for the two inch pipe. We have exactly the same, but for one and a half inch pipe. Uh, of course, uh, the same situation with uh, those rolls. Height of uh, those rolls is 100 millimeters, so it's very easy to calculate that amount of uh, rolls that you need for your extension or your moonshine steel. Yeah. So again, this old type of packing for the reflux stills, as you know. Yep, we go next. So this, the third one, whoop, some wrap of our box is SPP. So what's SPP? This is spiral prismatic packing. We produce them by ourselves. As you can see, we can uh, pack and uh, send you that amount of SPP that you need. So, if you need 100 milliliters, no problem, we can send 100. It's, it's, it will be very cheap for you because uh, shipping from Russia, small packages under 2, two, two kilograms is very cheap. Uh, of course, if you need 1 liter, for example, this is half a liter. Uh, 2 liters, 3 liters, 7, 10, 12, uh, 20, no problem, we can pack and send to any country in the world by usual mail. Yep, and let's go next. So we have also SPP, yep, this one uh, was 3.5, so 3.5 millimeter by, uh, by 3.5 millimeter, and this one is Whoop. five by five millimeters yep can see again. so there's not a problem for us to calculate that amount of SPP that you need so you just send us the size of your extension diameter and height and we can calculate that amount of SPP that you need and uh, yep let's go next so also we have, oh, yeah, this is actually uh, mesh for one and a half inch pipe. Yeah, there's a little bit differences in size. Of course, cost is also uh, different. Yep, and we have Cooper SPP. Yep, as you can see that. This is also 3.5 millimeter by 3.5 millimeter. Uh, if, of course, there's a lot of copper and the price is much higher than uh, compared to stainless steel. Yep, uh, absolutely no problem to ship worldwide and we can calculate same situation with uh, other patterns. And for the end, we have an exclusive Encalox simple saddles. Uh, and we provide them, or made them by ourselves. So this is copper, also high grade M1. This is saddles. You can uh, see them, the structure inside of the pack. Yep. So the thickness of this packing is one millimeter. So it will live for a long long time so if you we, we take into this type of mesh this is like well 0 0.15 of millimeter so very very thin this is is very thick and will take you for a long time it will like never die for usual home distillation 
yes uh, this is the most expensive packing and this is most exclusive i know the steel spirit uh, like makes uh, this type of uh, packing but we made a very hard uh, special form and we show you on the photos so it's really really cool yeah and let's take a look of uh, our packing in work yep right here we have our stripping column this is an old model but still work really really well so let's start from the boiler over here we have 25 liter boiler with a detachable lead so you can use it for the brewing liquid level We already close to the end. We already took a gallon of 96 ABV, like five liters to be uh, say the metrics. Yep, we have our like, simple automatic, which goes in this extension. Yeah, so solenoid regulate that amount of uh, liquid which goes from the liquid level, or liquid unit, under this deflagmator. Yep, this is deflagmator with a coil inside, so you really, really save a lot of water. Over here we have a side glass, just to be sure in how our uh, steel working. Is it working well? Yep. This is an old model because uh, this device uh, in uh, nowadays is larger, so it's like really has a big diameter, so you can uh, work with a higher amount of uh, voltage, or high, high amount of power. Right now we have maybe one and a half kilowatt. Yep electric heater inside of the boiler so we are already taking like really really small amount of alcohol I actually can increase that amount a little bit yeah because our automatic station is regulated amount of liquid which comes from our steel so inside of those of the so inside of these extensions, we have prismatic packing, uh, 3 by uh, 3.5 by 3.5. So it's uh, really, really good. And we can work up to maybe one and a half liter per hour of 96 ABV. So it's about 200 proof. Yeah. Over here we have our product cooler. As you can see, we have a side glass, side glass inside of this cooler. So, uh, this construction of this cooler, uh, we have spiral, which is inside of this cooler. So, product falls into this spiral and travels uh, about a meter and a half and cools to the 20 degrees so over here we have a jar and the product is very cold yeah so the construction of this stripping column is simple and can be working any station any home we have as I said one and a half uh, kilowatt and uh, as you can see that amount of water we can actually decrease that amount, but water in Russia is very, very cheap, so we don't really care. Yep, I like to hit it. Yep, on our website you can see different uh, constructions, like a little bit higher, a little bit wider, like this is 2 inch column. We have three inch and one and a half inch, and uh, 
different type of packing inside. Yep, that's pretty much it. I hope you enjoy this video. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe on our YouTube channel. And if you have any questions, you can write our Gmail, email, Twitter, Instagram, whatever you want. We're absolutely free to answer you. Yep, have a nice day and happy distilling.